dudes rock. Four years ago, pictures of my penis surfaced on the internet <laughs> next to a ruler demonstrating that it was four point seven eight two six five three eight inches long. That's a really detailed ruler. Immediately, people were calling me gay, the homo, <laughs> saying that my dick is small and I should kill myself, and this was the reason we need mm -hmm. to defund NPR. <laughs> Oh, shit. That happened to who's that? Ira Glass? That's Ira, yeah. Today, we're exploring why it's actually those people that are faggots. <laughs> and not me. And not Ira me. Glass. And that I'm cool. And I'm cool. My dick isn't even. And that was a it was a trick ruler. And my dick is actually much bigger than that. A lot of... The, a lot On of today's the, This the American an, Life. The answer to, to haters is to do reverse hating, is what we call it in my PhD program, where we... Study hating. <laughs> I actually I wrote my doctoral thesis on on being trolled and mm. how I'm a fag, and actually <laughs> it's everyone else that's a fag, and I'm cool. Damn, you whole thesis, huh? Yeah, I might try to get a humanities degree. It just it would be so easy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just You'd to become America's foremost African American. My PhD scholar. Like, do you think it's it's actually bad to say the N word? Yeah. Yeah, um, a study in... You're published. Yeah. You mean for... It's actually bad for black people to say it? You're you're, you're doing academic research um, on that? It's not my place to say that. It's, it's white people need to stop... Need to stop be saying on the N-word. Mm -hmm. Is that... But is that what your research would be on? Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's good, man. Mm -hmm. It would be cheap, too. That's the other thing. It's like... Yeah, it would be so easy, but then you're like... Yeah, I'm not about research. I'm about B-search. Okay, mm -hmm. you got to be about your research. You that's be right. About your studying, but you're not about research. We got to stop doing research because that's just that's just repeating something some other mm -hmm. guy. guy yeah, said. yeah, guy, yeah. fella. Some other player said. That's <laughs> a player. Yeah. <laughs> that's what that movie Ready Player One's about. <laughs> so yeah, it's about a player's ball. Yeah. yeah, it'd be funny if that. I mean. This is such a funny thing to pitch out as a joke. It's like, you know what would be funny? If something that didn't happen at all <laughs> was actually... It was like there was like it, a translation it, it error. Happen. And then so like in all video games, they came over for Japan instead of player. Mm. Uh -huh. And how... Well, okay. I don't know yeah. exactly how that... Yeah. You're right. Press a statue. <laughs> <laughs> is that, yeah. yes. So the player would have been replaced by a different word, is yeah. what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah. That different word one, that different word two. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. That would be funny. You're yeah, right. that would be funny. <laughs> If it was the N word instead of player in every video game, mm -hmm. <laughs> wouldn't that be funny? <laughs> yeah, I have to yeah. admit that would be funny. <clears throat> then kids wouldn't be saying it on Xbox Live because it would have got out of their system. Would've, they would have gotten out of their system. So it's the Japanese's fault. The Japanese could have saved a generation of white kids from being racist. Yeah, I'm going to Japanese you to suck my dick. Whoa. Oh. That would be awesome. You should have yeah. you should have thought of that when we were there and said it to one of them. I did. I was going around saying that to all of them. <laughs> you said it to everyone. <laughs> like, when Nick disappeared, he was calling. That's he was, what he was doing yeah, for his day. He's like, I really cracked it today. I, I got to go test something out. I was doing research out. for my doctoral thesis. Yeah. Right. Do <laughs> Japanese people understand the N-word if you scream it at them? <laughs> yes. What, what were your findings? At Harvard University. <laughs> what were your findings? I don't know. I forgot to write shit down. Uh, mm -hmm. I was so... I was so in 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 trans no in um I'm trying to think of the right word in yeah uh, in the zone in in um in uh having a good time yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, that's uh -huh. that honestly that brings up some red flags because yeah. it's one thing to scream it at the Japanese. because I was doing I was doing B search. Mm -hmm. Right, right. I was being about you're the not research. trying to do another man's research. I'm not trying to research. Yeah, I'm you're doing, doing B search, research, which is original research. The original search. Mm -hmm. You're doing an original search. I'm doing original search. I'm not looking into something again. Yeah, mm -hmm. I guess that is what research means. Mm -hmm. It's just redoing a search. A search again. someone else. Right, did. you're using sources, mm -hmm. which is stealing, as we all know. Yeah. No, you can cite it. That's your problem. You've never cited your sources. I would never cite a Your source. extensive sources. 
Every set you do has it should have a bibliography. Yeah. Well, there is. <laughs> you hand footnotes. it out. You hand it out at the end there of every footnotes. set. Yeah, it's like uh, it's like that um, like that book. Uh, what do you call it? The big fat chicken book. chicken soup for yeah, for book. for being a for fucking penis, yeah. penis loving scoundrel. Yeah, it's like that book. <laughs> <laughs> the lion, the witch, in the wardrobe. The lion who sucked my dick robe. Mm. How about that? Mm-hmm. Yeah. And it's about a wardrobe. That, uh, you go in a closet that sucks and a lion sucks you Yeah, a lion sucks you off. Oh. Yeah, that would be cool. cool. Mm-hmm. <laughs> would you be scared the lion would bite your cock off? Yeah, I wouldn't just, accept a blowjob from a lion. I would love to go through that closet, and then that the lion, Aslan, is like, welcome to Narnia. And I'm like, what's it called again? He's like, it's called Narnia. And then uh-huh. he's like, this is a magical place. I'm like, what was the name one more time? He's like, it's Narnia. Yeah. I'm like, how many ends are in that? He's like... Two. Uh-huh. He's like, anyways, it's a ma- I'm a talking lion, and I'm like, can you tell me how many ends are in Narnia again? And he's like, what the fuck? What is going on? Yeah. Uh-huh. And I'm like, it's it's some real world thing. You don't understand, but oh, you don't think they have racial slurs in Narnia? Yeah. Well, mm-hmm. there's no reason to. I don't know. What I, is? I don't. I haven't read the book. You. Uh, you know, it'd be cool to do a claymation show for children. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right, and it's on for years. It's the most successful show. And then it, after it's been on for years, it comes out that all all of the clay was, was, shit? was actually shit and cum. <laughs> oh, oh, and cum. <laughs> so children were just looking at shit and cum. That would be mm-hmm. good. Yeah. Is it abusive if they have to look at it? Well, yes. I guess. Yeah, people would not be happy about it. <laughs> no, no. But you know what? Why not? Yeah. Why not? What does you it know? even matter? And they then, didn't know at the anything, time. If anything, you, you're, you're not wasting... Precious material. Yeah. The kid was passed out. The whole yeah, my, my bitch just found out that the the clay on Sesame Street's just a bunch of shit and cum. <laughs> no, that's another thirty years for JD Power, my friend. <laughs> yeah. yeah, my bitch loves finding shit out. They yeah, offer live in game wagering. Are you laughing about the like Down syndrome guy that loves public intellectuals? Yeah, yeah. Well, my, Mikey really wants to be a public intellectual. <laughs> I like. I like Noam Chomsky <laughs> and Norman, Norman Mawa, <laughs> Thomas Sewell. Eh. Yeah, he just that no ideological distinction. Yeah, yeah. He yeah. just yeah, likes, he likes Norman he wants, Miller and Gore Vidal. Well, we got him a bunch of turtlenecks last year for his birthday, <laughs> but of, of course he quickly stretched them all out. <laughs> Got a strong neck. Yeah, uh, we actually turned the basement into his own talk show. Yeah, you know, he has his own uh, roundtable <laughs> municipal policy discussion show that he runs down there. It's nice. It's a nice little living room setup. That they've changed the direction of the stop signs down on Eighth Street, and a lot of people are recognizing the racial undertones of that decision. <laughs> Michael, what do you have to say about it? It's just a bunch of stuff. It's stuff that <laughs> <laughs> very good, Michael. Very, very good. Very interesting point. Yeah. Well, we had to take him to the hospital because he burned himself on his imaginary tea. <laughs> <laughs> We're still not sure how he did it, but he's covered in third degree burns from spilling an imaginary cup of coffee all over himself. <laughs> oh, shit. That's the first time I ever knew what an erection was. Was I was wearing pajama pants. And watching Mad TV with my family. Oh, nice! And my dad like turned around and he saw that I had a boner coming out of my pajama pants. You're wait, wait, you're f- you're f- yeah. I was like, like in flesh? Third, third or fourth grade. Your cock flesh was exposed. Yeah, yeah. To your no parents. underwear, pajama pants. <laughs> and then my dad just shouted, "Joanne, he's got an erection." And then then they rushed to the hospital to get an MRI. <laughs> And then they got an MRI. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> Something's wrong with my boy. <laughs> uh, no, sir, his penis is just that small. <laughs> it's ho- He's got it's, a very small growth. It's still <laughs> protruding. It's still soft, but it looks hard. They're like, no, that's as big as it's going to get. That wasn't as big as it's it was going to get. Just for the record, for anyone that's listening and thinks Nick may be doing a funny bid. <laughs> My dick has grown since third grade. No, it hasn't. Yes, it has. How much? Not a lot. How big is your dick, Adam? Soft? No. Hard. E- either way. You want to know both? Yeah, give me both measurements. Soft? 13 and a half inches. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, it is. It's coiled around my leg. <laughs> Hard? 2.5. My dick's probably like three inches soft. That's a big soft dick, no. dude. That's huge. 
three inches soft. Maybe then two. Three is not big. My dick is nothing <laughs> soft. My dick goes into my body like a turtle. Hard. It's phenomenal. Fantastic. It's not that good. I give it a round probably. of applause. <laughs> <laughs> and my dick is probably, like I said, a har- a, th- a thirsty 5.75 when it's hard. That's right smack dab in what meaty, we're told is the average a for thick American male penis. One vein running through it, yeah. curving to the left and coming up just slightly. Uncircumcised. <laughs> Am I picking up a picture here? <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, they, they got me pretty good at you. Took about Chinese food. All I had was a salad for breakfast. I'm pissed off now. I'm sorry, man. I'm that wasn't cool of us. I'm pi- no, it's not your fault. I want it so no, bad. No, it's like you're trying to not do crack, and then I want to like, suck a fucking. I want to. And wa- then we're like, you know, oh, what's be your awesome? favorite flavor of crack? You know, it'd be awesome if you could suck one long lo mein noodle for eternity. Oh. Uh. And you're just eating it forever. Yeah. That- that would be cool. That would be so fucking tight. Like dude. like when cartoons where someone goes to hell and they're being force fed from a conveyor belt. No, not like that. In a nice way. In a, it where it's one slow. Have you thought about getting a tapeworm to help you with your diet? Um, I think there's other negative health mm-hmm. side effects. Have you considered doing that 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 thing where you eat an African child's shit? And then to to get the flora and fauna. Yeah, that's a big celeb craze. <laughs> that, do people really do that? Yeah, a lot of celebs are... Well, yeah. they get their ass. They have... No, I mean, the eating it is a joke. But they do, like, get African children's shit and have it, like, put into their ass. What? Mm-hmm. Yeah, they change their, like, gut chemistry. Why African children's shit? Because if you're going to do anything, you might as well take it from Africa. If you're a millionaire and you're involved in some fad, mm. it has to involve stealing resources yeah. from Africa. Mm-hmm. Yes, yes. We've already Being taken colonial. all the uh, we've taken all the other resources. Neo colonialism. Now it's now we need the poo poo. It's it, shit. I wonder if there's a woke account being like, "Yo, they're ste- they stealing our shit." <laughs> 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 He's got <it>. Christopher <laughs> Christopher uh, co- colon bus uh-huh. something like that. I don't know. <laughs> There's definitely someone that's going to say they're stealing our shit. Yeah. They're taking everything. Yeah. The Nina, they're the taking pink. our baby's shit. The Nina, the Porto, and the Potty Maria. <laughs> <laughs> no, man, I don't know. I'm just fucking sleepy. I only got six. I'm, I got the Fitbit, and it's tracking my sleep. I only got six hours today. Yeah. I you like need to, your eight. I like to get eight. Yeah. Most people need it. I like to get eight, but I have six. It's the story of my penis. Mm-hmm. But you don't have sex. Well, I think pretty close. <laughs> <laughs> I think functionally it's six, you know. I, uh, I haven't taken a ruler to it to quite mm-hmm. some time. It might have had a little growth spurt. I'll have you know, I tell people six for you. Thanks, man. I say, mm-hmm. you know, my friend Stav, he's got a six inch. Yeah, day. now people you People ask pretty often. People are always asking. Well, yeah, but that's right. We had Remember that the Sean Patton thing? Yeah, where he said I had a big dick, and oh, Adam yeah, Sean, said no. Yeah, I should. That yeah, was that was wild, me. dude. <laughs> it was just that he didn't have a. Uh, I guess it was, he just he just let you know. Maybe yeah. Sean's got a really little dick, and my dick did look big. I don't know. I think he was taking his dick out that night. Actually, did it look nice? I didn't see. I saw his ass. <laughs> no, this that this was is a recently. different time. This is a different. This time. is this is way long ago. This oh, is when you were on moms, stage, and he said yeah. my dick yeah. looked nice. Oh, that's yeah. Recently, and you said no. I just Damn, I feel like we should have stayed on that thread of uh, Kong feces door. Yeah, just the whole idea of like colonizers going and stealing, stealing shit, shit and woke people being out yeah. and, uh, mad about it. Mm-hmm. A younger, uh, you know, a, a killer. The killer in me would have gone after that one. Right, we pick, can go pick the meat get back into ones. it. Oh, it's fuck. so fun to talk like that. <clears throat> Maybe I'm literally dying. Of I've what? had to piss from not more. eating enough. I don't know. But this has been a problem as long as I've known you. It's a lot a lot of pissing. It's more than usual recently. Have you ever considered yeah. possibly 
Instead of a human being, you're actually a giant pitcher filled with lemonade <laughs> that <laughs> bursts through a wall. I have and, not. Can I be honest? And your dissatisfaction would, in life is that you're not like destroying houses to introduce kids to lemonade. Yeah, that's I would your be true so. Form. I would be so pissed if I was not a human. Mm-hmm. Yeah. If I'm some robot or some shit or like some you're anthropomorphic fucking a big a giant bladder <laughs> filled with <laughs> with piss and <laughs> yeah with sugary piss. Yeah, a piss filled Kool Aid. You're man. created for a <laughs> defunct brand. <laughs> yeah, dude. If I'm if I'm <laughs> if I'm a fucking thrown away mascot mm. that just exists uh-huh. sort of in a nether realm mm-hmm. right now, I'd be fucking pissed and off. And you're constantly just like denying your true self, mm-hmm. trying to trying to be a like a, a real human. man. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and I that's that's why my dick doesn't work. That's why I piss all the time. I saw a Dalmatian the other day. You don't see those very often. They look. Uh, they all died on nine eleven. I think so. Damn. Look, yeah. How many Dalmatians died on 9 11? 101. <laughs> That's how many there were. The firefighters <laughs> sent the Dalmatians in first to yeah. the towers. Mm-hmm. And the, they weren't doing shit. No. They got they got fucked up. They were eating all the snacks Cru- the, in the offices. Cruella Alville was the. Cruella Alville. <laughs> was the Muslim. It's a Muslim. Uh, uh-huh. Oh, oh nice. I, to, I got some bushings for you. Yeah. All over my cock. Do you? Yeah. You have your Stav's dick pubes. squeezed into... <laughs> Stav's pubes go all the way to the top of his dick. <laughs> yeah, that would be But awesome. only on the top. Yeah, yeah. Like, like, uh, like a little fucking palm tree. Like a strong-willed native character in like, you know, something like Avatar or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The guy that doesn't trust the main guy. Of course. Because he's trying to date the other well, guy. The, oh, yeah, the yeah, yeah, yeah. The native guy who actually wants pussy from the... From the, hot, no, no, no. the native show. guy that that is the older brother of oh, okay, the okay. native bitch that's getting fucked by the John Smith character. Yes, yeah. yes, yes, yes. The yes, that's a great. Yeah, that's a great. Pull. That's who your dick is. That's who my dick is. It yeah. is proud. Who eventually comes around to the norm, at the end the white and that's thing. when it's time to fu- to vanquish the enemy together. Mm-hmm. When he's like, "I'm glad you're fucking my my sister." Mm-hmm. I'm glad your 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 colonizing cock is busting all up mm. in those walls. Mm. How about instead of John Goodman, it's John Badman? Mm-hmm. He's like, mm-hmm. "Well, I'm a I'm a pedophile, friend. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing, brother? I molest children. <laughs> yeah. Are there any uh, children around here? Maybe I could molest. That's good. That'd be a lot better if I could do a John Goodman. Impression. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't sound anything yeah, like this. Is the rare time like. where you don't even have a piece of it. I don't. I mean, I can't even <laughs> think about what he sounds like. Yeah, because usually you're too hard on your impressions. Mm-hmm. You're like, ah, you're that pretty wasn't good. good, but yeah. you 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 get the point across. This time it does not sound anything like John. I don't Goodman. know what John Goodman sounds like. I can't visualize his voice. Wow, no. something like yeah, that. Every time you try to do an impression, you're just doing Ray Comp. <laughs> <laughs> you're doing Tim Dillon doing Ray Comp. Ah, uh, uh, it's it's you got to start fat. That's the thing. Yeah, but you're doing. You're not. You are not. First of all. You're not even saying words. <laughs> You're just going <laughs> rah. Yeah. Yeah, cuz like it's like it's like when you tune something you go uh, before you sing. You know when people do that where they blow on the little thing they go uh, Yeah. Yeah. And like an a cappella group or that's something. That's me like, trying yeah. to get into the right zone. Oh. Uh, uh. Yeah, that, I don't I'm know trying to think well, How are you doing? How are you doing, friend? I'm a pedophile. <laughs> uh, that's better. Yeah, but that's it's not better. Good. John Badman. John mm-hmm. Bad. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good bit. <laughs> well, I'm bad. I'm yeah. bad because I have sex with kids. <laughs> oh, here's here's the thing I was thinking of. Uh, what about what about Christopher Uber? Mm. Uh, it's Christopher Lambert, but, but he drives, he drives Uber. Uber. Mm-hmm. Did you get a Toyota Corolla? <laughs> yeah, he's just on a Bluetooth with his <laughs> brother. Yeah, yeah, they're always like they're always talking soft. I always feel like they're like cybering. Yeah, because <laughs> they're always like. <laughs> yeah, it is like it's it's sensual. But yeah, it don't, it kind of like <laughs> they just be hard. Hard. It hits your ear in a way that's like stop. It feels like they're tonguing your ear. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I would much rather you be yelling. Yeah, than honestly, than yeah. Kind of. I agree. I, I agree. always feel terrible when they're like. Can't can I talk on the phone? They have never asked me once. I've been asked. Well, I've been a asked times. a couple of times. Yeah, and then they like go back on their Bluetooth. And my my and rating. I say no. My rating has to be zero. 
<laughs> You're rude. My Uber rating has to be fucking dog shit. <laughs> you can tell. There was one time, there was some like Albanian guy or something. He's like, man, you put your f- like feet on my chair, and I didn't at all. I was there. I was we sitting, were going to the airport. No, this was a different time. Well, I was by the myself. same thing happened. I was by myself, and I was sitting like this. And the guy's like, you put your f- like feet. I'm like, I didn't. And then I was screaming at him. Like, <laughs> Nick yeah. got so mad. Called him a couple You have stuff. no de-escalation skills. I will say that. <laughs> yeah. Once it's on, it's on. <laughs> it's like once somebody... You're perfectly polite until the second some, like... Well, if you accuse me of some shit I didn't do, fuck well, that. You could have... You I've lived tr- my whole life that <laughs> See, way. See, that's what I'm of shit that I didn't <laughs> fucking do. This is interesting. I wonder where the psychological root of this is. Being accused of shit I didn't yeah, do. Yeah, what was the first accusation? Let's get to the fucking bottom of it. It might if it if it wraps up in some doing something fat, then we really are in the middle of like your entire psyche. No, I don't think it was. You know, somebody if, broke if somebody something. stole you stole well, caught you or accused you of stealing like a, a muffin or yeah. something, no. <laughs> then that would be the explanation for everything. If a retarded man <laughs> accused you of stealing, I don't have his any muffin. animosity to the retarded. No, you're right. You're right. You're They're right. very funny. You're right. You're right. Pastorum. That's me. That's Adam. The only yeah. reason to be gay is because it's a secret. Yeah. Yeah. That's the fun. That's, that's part. the appeal to me. <laughs> yeah. The secret part. <laughs> All these damn yeah. queers that's why I'm out a, loud. That's why I'm against LGBT stuff, because if you take away being secretly gay, it ruins it. Yeah. It ruins the whole Gays used to the, be it spies. Ruins the thrill, dude. Mm-hmm. They used to be they used to be like James Bond. James Bond Frank Spence. <laughs> And they used to have very good art. Richard Simmons. You know, now we have fucking, what's his name? Gary Glitter. Whatever the fuck his name is. Gary Glitter was a pedophile. It only takes a few minutes. Glitter guy. Randy Glitter. Gary Randy Rainbow. Randy Rainbow. Reading. (laughs) (laughs) LeVar Burton. (laughs) Famous homosexual. (laughs) Randy Rainbow. The chewables from BlueChew.com can be taken on a full or empty side. That's right. You know, I'm not. It only takes a few minutes. It ships directly to your door in discreet packaging. Very discreet packaging. It's got swastikas mm. all over it. <laughs> People are like, yeah, what is this that? guy's a Nazi, oh, but his dick is, works fine. It's is Nazi what it literature. Yeah. <laughs> it's Mark Twain, but they put in more N-words. <laughs> it's the adventures of Beeple Berry it's Beep. The double, it's, not, it's the double <laughs> abridged. <laughs> the N-ventures of Beeple Berry Beep. <laughs> <laughs> by, wow. by Mark Ass Twain. <laughs> Mark Ass Twain. Adventures of People Berry Bleep. <laughs> yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, it's in a book. It's in a book. Tom hollowed out. Tom, All the dick pills are in that book. Tom Every Sayer. Month. Yeah, Tom N. Sayer. Tom Sayer. Yeah. <laughs> and Bleepleberry Bleep, it comes over and he's like, what, what you doing that fast, Tom? What you be, what you be doing? He's like, I'm paying the N-word on it. <laughs> like, Why? Like, I don't know. Some bitch told me to. <laughs> Some bitch said, my, I could, I could, she'd suck my dick if I paint this thing. Wow. Shit, okay. I'm trying to get my dick sucked. He's like, well, why don't you paint the fence, that motherfucker? <laughs> And then he did, and then Tom, yeah. when he got some pussy on the side, well, that bitch wow. called himself the N-word on the fence. <laughs> wow. That's awesome. That's a good book. Yeah. What else happens? They, oh, they I don't fake know. their death. I was lying. I've never read that gay bullshit. You didn't? You didn't read it in middle school? I, they, I tried to, but it was mm-hmm. fucking boring. Well, I'll tell you what. Here's what's not boring. The, getting your dick hard? The no in-person doctor visit. The getting, yeah. Doing the video conference. Which, zooming, Adam, you have, you have some experience. Zooming with. into the meeting yeah. at Bluetooth.com to get BL. I take them like vitamins. I don't know if you're supposed to. Mm-hmm. I haven't had sex in months, and I just take a dick pill every day mm-hmm. to get my dick hard and to elevate my heart rate. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. And so that's another way to, and because it tastes like candy. Mm-hmm. And so, you know what? You could do that too, guys. Yeah. Um, just I had fu- it, honestly, I did one time, I took a dick pill and I fucked. And then uh, it sometimes it lasts, the effects last a nice amount of time. And I had a weird dream the next day about fucking an old lady. Mm-hmm. And I woke up and I was just, in my dream, I was pounding this old bitch. And you got pussy in it. I literally woke up, I'm not even joking, humping my bed. I, cool. I was fucking. My dick was like pushing into my bed, and my and my dick was like pushed up onto my stomach. It kind of hurt. I had a cool dream that I was in like a defensive driving class, and everyone was calling me an idiot. Mm-hmm. And uh, and then you shot up the school. No, and then <laughs> a bunch of people got trapped under ice, and I had to swim under the ice and save them. 
And I was the only person that could do it. Was your, and your dick was hard from BlueChew.com. It was from BlueChew. <laughs> but then half the people were dead in the dream. Damn. And they were like, well, thanks for recovering the bodies, at least. Damn. Well, you got half of them. That's pretty were good. Were you wearing scuba gear? Or were you just... I was just... I just went in. Damn, bro. They're, They're like, respect. if anyone else does it, they'll die. They'll die, but not you. Because no, you, you have, have been, been taking, talking about... taking cold showers. You've been, yeah, exactly. You've been talking about cold water You've swimming. Too. You dude, I want to do... I want to go to Brighton and, and do the... Let's like, go, dude. I got my wet. Suit. All right, I I need somebody to because if you you can just die. I'm Next, not interested. If you do in that, it wrong, if you just go in there and you don't like, yeah. I would probably die. You uh, start you, hanging you, out with the not Russian die guys. From the polar bear plunge, bro. <laughs> well, if you do, if you just don't, if you, I mean, if you jumped in the water, that'd probably fuck you up. Mm-hmm. Walking out there. Oh, you gotta jump. Yeah, you gotta jump. You just got you gotta bring a shit ton of cigarettes so you can warm up after. Yeah, mm-hmm. get your lungs fucking hot. Yeah, you gotta the inside. You gotta you gotta. It's like a <laughs> you gotta take engine. a big ass bong rip and yeah. then jump. And yeah, then nothing makes me inside. gets me hotter. So than use bluechew.com dot com yeah. promo code cometown. Just pay five dollars shipping. That's b l u e chew dot com promo code cometown. Cometown is spelled. Uh, C. Oh, fuck. You got it, dude. Um, Sound it out. Uh, you. Uh, and, and, oh, I know that one from the candy. M. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh-huh. T, O, w, w, and N as in. Uh-huh. And, oh no, sorry. <laughs> no, I, sh- I should erase that part. I don't know why that's in the copy. <laughs> that's the only one they mm-hmm. tell you how to spell phonetically. Mm-hmm. Interesting. Yeah, just calling up. <laughs> Uh, C is in. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay. We're not. Yeah, we don't have to do this. Everyone can figure out where this bit is going at mm-hmm. home. <clears throat> but if you're new to the show, I think you could probably also figure it out. Mm-hmm. If you, it would be funny if somebody started listening like right now. Mm-hmm. They're like, "This is jacked up. <laughs> <laughs> these guys are fucking fucked up, mm-hmm. twisted, if you will." Yeah, <laughs> one twisted of these guys is hot. Mm-hmm. He sounds from the awesome. voice from the I voice. I can tell, yeah. mm-hmm. and he's got an awesome one laugh. Of these guys I want to suck his cock. Sounds physically overheated. No, to the extent that he had to remove his clothes in 15 <laughs> degree weather. <laughs> First of all, I'm wearing lo- I'm wearing heat gear leggings. Thank you very much. So mm-hmm. I'm hot. I'm running hot from the bottom. So I'm letting a little steam off up top. Damn leggings remind me of the woods. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I wish I wish we were still. We're gonna go with... back, dude. This show is gonna become a vacation show. Yeah, that'd we're be gonna cool. go on mm-hmm. four vacations a, a year. Mm-hmm. Do all the episodes. We should have. They should give us. Look, if guys grow, if diners, drive-ins, and dives can be on the air for now, I think at this point, thirty-seven years. That's, I'm yeah. pretty sure that's true. Then there's no reason that we can't have. I would love to have a travel log show. And they're like, mm-hmm. we're here at McDonald's. Yeah. And we're here at the pizza place right by the cabin that we got. <laughs> yeah. We're at we're at the McDonald's in fucking <laughs> in Wilmington, Delaware. <laughs> the only one where you're allowed to smoke inside. <laughs> Sir, can you put that out, please? Shut up. <laughs> After telling the bitch to shut up, we continued smoking. <laughs> And eating some PBJs we brought from home. Eating peanut butter and Gina <laughs> sandwiches. Oh, yeah. That's some <laughs> yummy stuff. Uh-huh. Adam, why the fuck isn't the URL on this copy? On the the the, the, the menu? Well, size. the URL is on the other page that I put. Can what other page? The, the one little that one? Said, the the little one that one. sucked? Well, if you put them the one together. that fucking sucked, bro. Look, I'm trying. What to, do we need? Two pages? Look at this, dude. I, I'm trying to read this, and it's giving. I'm me, sorry, dude. It's giving Nick, me a you take a break. Take I a work, breather, dude. I work too <laughs> you goddamn work too hard. Too damn hard, bro. Yeah. <laughs> to be reading a sideways being, ass Ad, paper. Adam's Mark Twaining me into having to do more work than Which I want. Which is so I'm not fucked Mark up. Mark Twaining you. Yeah. So fucked up. I just printed it in landscape. Sam Hamburger Clemens. Style. Sam you think my boy Sammy got pussy? The man who prints sideways is known to have a small dick. <laughs> yep. But if that wasn't enough, he's also gay. Mm, mm. Fuck. Well, Mark Twain was, uh, you know, not just very funny, but also very insightful. <laughs> <laughs> There's, and he had some great views on the Jewish uh, people. Uh, Lincoln, it was said that Lincoln knew Adam, <laughs> and he <laughs> thought he was a fag. <laughs> hey, wow. She, yeah, yeah. It's Shelby Foote uh, in the Civil War documentary. Oh, wow. Well, well, yeah, shouts out to our boy Shelby. Mm-hmm. Uh, a lot of people think Shelby is a gay name. It's a girl's <laughs> name. They would often tease me about it, and I would always say to them, actually, it's Adam that's a girl's name. <laughs> How and, they would, and they would say that's true. There are a lot of Adams that are not girls. Uh, 
most of them. Yeah, actually. Adam Sandler's cool. Who else? Adam Adam uh, West, Batman. Adam West is okay. Adam Driver. Adam Girls. Driver. Adam Kylo Driver. Ren. Yeah. Um, I could take or leave Adam Driver. I don't mind him. I know it's cool to not like him. Or a is lot it of people, cool? A lot of people are like, he's ugly. Don't say he's cute. No, I, I mean, think he's cute. I think he could get his. I think he could lay some pipe. Yeah, but I'm I think just he's saying. Cute. You know, I, I want to rewatch Star Wars on mushrooms, man. <laughs> it's very bad. If you no. Take it back. On mushrooms, I don't know. It's awesome on mushrooms. I've never seen the new ones without mushrooms. And by the way, the old one's not that good. Which ones? I don't know. I rewatched them. They weren't that good. I rewatched Empire. It was not that good. Yeah, everyone knows Revenge of the Sith, the best one. Is that what people say? No. <laughs> Which one is Revenge of the Sith? I know. I think Sith? it's like there's like... Oh, I love Revenge of the Sith in the in the movie theater. I think Which the, one is Revenge of the Sith? I that's, think that's part three, That's maybe? the last or one of the two? prequels. Oh, yeah. I, I'm, yeah. I'm due for... Uh, Getting fucked up and watching all of those movies and passing out ten minutes into the first yeah. one. Into the pod racing scene. You know what I want to do? I've never seen Lord of the Rings. I want to take mushrooms and watch Lord of it's the Rings. It's not good, dude. I don't I, think I've it's tried good. To, I've tried a billion times to be like, but you, you know, know what? what? I'm doing it. I'm getting a fucking bag of, of pizzeria pretzel combos. Respect. Mm-hmm. I'm, taking some, respect. I'm taking some pills. Family size, mm-hmm. I hope. And yes. And then also <laughs> Muddy Buddy checks. Oh, oh no. Muddy oh, Buddies, bro. Oh, come come on. on. Yeah. That is the yeah. good that shit. That just got me happy. Doing a couple of lines of blow. Mm. <laughs> fucking okay. taking some Kratom pills. <laughs> snorting ketamine. And yep. then doing Percocet. Yeah. Now I'm ready to understand. Enjoy. Now you're at art. <laughs> a, a film. Now, yeah. I'm, now I'm ready <laughs> to be a guy that hasn't had a drink in eight years. Yep. I'm so proud of you for being sober. <laughs> <laughs> to be ready. To get up, down, up, up, down, down, and up, and middle. Yeah. Just being regular. <laughs> just fucking really... To just, just take all that stuff and just be in the middle. Don't you feel like when you take mushrooms and you look in the mirror, you look like an elf? When I take... When I've done ketamine in the past and I've looked in the mirror, I look like the ugliest person I've well, ever seen. Yeah, because the dissociative... My face. The dissociative will turn I hate my face so much. all, like, just different discrete components, so it's like, I hate it. You're looking at it and it's just, like, eyes and a nose and a mouth and shit. I'm like... This is one of the most Maybe I gotta just sort of, like, seen. placed on your head. Yeah, and it's just, so... Like, like, like di- Mr. It, Potato Head It style. really hurts really? my feelings. Yeah, yeah you, I maybe, can't look in the mirror when I'm done ketamine. You sent us a really ugly picture this morning. You looked hideous. I yeah, know. I looked, thought we were all sending ugly pics. Wait, no, what? We, see, we were sending, looked good. We looked good, but you looked like a. I looked good. You, Adam, me you I look like you just ga- like went through a difficult labor in that picture. <laughs> well, <laughs> you I really did. Really do. Do. Then he looked like it's just. I'm so you happy really to be a do, mom. Man. I thought we were all sending each there's other pics from bed. There's a man looking the color, down at this woman, co- and he's oh, like, yeah. "Look how disgusting." That I guess this bitch gave me a son. Yeah, why you guys will never be able to fuck this woman? No, I'm looking at it from. I thought this was just for us. This is you after a difficult day. To do a cesarean, <laughs> at, but you did blow your pussy out. I've been pussy trying blown. to get it out. Pussy first. blown out, and then they had to. And then they're like, uh, and they, they still push it back C-section. in and did a C-section. Oh, you God. really think my picture was ugly, Adam? No, I thought we were all sending each other bedroom photographs. I wasn't in this, bed. This I was sitting bed, at my yeah. table doing work. I'm fucking I up we were in the doing morning. Boudoir no, me and Stop both. Get I was up. I was sending emails, working on some projects. I get up at seven a.m. every day. You're snoozing like a fucking bitch. Yeah. Looking bad, looking dehydrated. On the, on the how to print stuff out like an asshole Wikipedia page. <laughs> Listen, I'm in the middle what's of the, moving What's the right most now? asshole way to print? Stop, you Landscape. do actually look nice. You know, your, skin, your skin looks really good. Thank Say something you. nice about me, too. Thank you. Nick, I like that spittule on your lip. <laughs> yeah. It's coffee. Is it coffee? Yeah. My you skin also looks spittle. good. Your, your skin does look good. My skin is pretty your uh, skin dried is out right now. Yeah. Thank you, Adam. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. I and told you, want, you that my skin gets dried out when I don't use my dandruff shampoo enough. Is that so? The rest I have of your something skin? called dermatitis, and the central column of my face <laughs> yeah. dries out. Okay. You have spermatitis? I'm trying to do a medical uh, fucking. Well, you know what? Will absolutely you know what's, cure dermatitis yep. 100% guaranteed by the FDA. Yeah. <laughs> and we're allowed to make that claim legally. Uh, no. uh, we don't know what that is. And it's a photo start. We're getting it started as quickly as possible. And we started, and Adam and is still in the living Adam's room. Adam's in the living room. And his dick is small. And he's trying to find his penis, and he can't and find it. And he can't it. find it. And he's he's picked up a... Picking ch- up speed now is he doesn't even have a penis. A he thimble. doesn't even have a penis coming up, coming up on the left. It's a thimble monopoly piece, and he's saying, is this my penis? 
is this? Hello, everyone. It's me, Adam Friedland. <laughs> this is my normal speaking voice. <laughs> oh, we I'm... started recording? Hold on. Hold on. Let me put on my radio yeah, voice. And I'm ready. Hey, guys. Welcome to Come Town. Oh, I don't oh, know. Wait, we cu- we, hey, we'll cut out the first we'll part. We'll cut out the first part. Everyone heard your, you regular, speaking. your regular voice. We'll fix that. Your um, really cool voice is definitely not like an effet British guy, which is what you actually are. That's yeah. right. Just That's kidding. True. That's a joke. My second. As act- everyone who listens knows, we're actually best friends. We would never <laughs> reveal a secret like that. I, I don't. That want Adam to is know. actually a three foot eleven British man. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I am the turtle <laughs> dove that we, guy. That we He's just, Manx. He's a That's man. Right. A man Manx, Manxkish, Manx, Manx, what are they fucking people Manx-ish? called? Manxish? Like a Manx, like someone from Manchester? People from the Isle of Man. Oh. Isn't that what yeah. that is? They're I Manx? That's like, isn't that a place where people launder money? Um, it's what I do there. I think it's a banking haven. I, tell, I go there, I ride my motorcycle around, and I wash all my money off. That's right. I love washing yep. my money. Mm-hmm. I went there, and I was very upset when I got there. Because mm-hmm. you thought there would be no pussy, I and thought it was there were be chicks. All cock. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I was saying before the show started that, and I get this a, just a vibe check, a vibe if you get this. Let's but do a quick vibe. Joanne check. Fabrics, the Joanne <laughs> of Joanne Fabrics. <laughs> I get the sense that she sucks your dick only on your birthday once a year, mm-hmm. but it's mind blowing. Yes, yeah, yeah. She's, she's rocking your shit. She's bro. just going to town, but it's just that once a year, and then she like clasps her dumb jewelry back on. Mm-hmm. She's got a jewelry box. For she's got sure. a jewelry box, absolutely. And then she she's drives got a little her. haircut. She's got big fat titties that have only gotten larger with age. Mm-hmm. They're so big she can literally steer. And then the she drives not that big. Her SL five hundred to a charity. Yeah. yeah, a charity dinner. <laughs> but you can tell, dude. Where the- some yeah, some old Italian guy with transitional lenses is giving a speech and he's <laughs> touching her lower back. And normally that would bother you, but you just you did you you look over and you know you just busted the fattest load that it you doesn't had. Doesn't even matter. Yeah. You know in her in twenty years in her stomach intertwined. And with- here I am, just some kept man, with usually a, a cuck, mm-hmm. living off my wife's fabric money. That's right. But yeah. not today. She yeah. doesn't view you. As she a thought I was man. an airline pilot. That's mm-hmm. right. I was a doorman. Mm. You just same uniform. I smashed once because she thought I was an airline pilot for six months, yeah. but I was just the doorman of her building. <laughs> <laughs> oh, funny, Nick! I keep bumping yeah. into you when I'm leaving at the I lobby. Just like opening. Yeah, floor. no, I'm always coming and going. You know, I'm flying in places. Yeah, so. I was just mm-hmm. in uh, Mumbai. I just can't, I was. <clears throat> I left the. Uh, I left the. Uh, the Ar- uh, Antarctica, and I just came back here to pick up some things. Pick and up some, I've left my lunch. <clears throat> I headed back to the airport now. The, you mind giving me some of that pussy I keep hearing about? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Joanne. <laughs> Joanne. It's not too much trouble. Young Joanne. I, Young Joanne just working at a fabric you store. You just, yeah. Mm-hmm. You, so you make you make stuff like bitch clothes or something? Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, so Monday I'm going to have my own fabric empire. <laughs> well, do you suck dick every single day? Every day until I'm rich. What until, a liar. And then, but then she found out you're not an airline pilot. Mm. You're just some fucking asshole. Yep. Opening and closing the door. And getting pussy from her in the broom closet. Yeah, but you know how to lay pipe. And that was that's, and what, that's, that's what, what got that was your, your saving grace. That's what got your foot in the door. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. And now you're Mr. Joanne Fabric. I would love to be. Yeah, I was. I was saying. I was also saying that there was a lady that I worked with in college. She was like the secretary of the University of Maryland Baltimore County um, uh, Graduate School. Mm-hmm. Let's go ahead and just give her full name while we're mm-hmm. at it. Her name I is don't remember Karen. Her name. But the thing is, she had Sanders. big. I used to beat off in the bathroom of that. Job. I just remember that show you put <laughs> on at, work. at UMBC where they still had like a. Like a set up from some like musical or something. Yes. Yeah. 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 At uh, Fat Tuesdays. Yeah. At our oh fuck, I didn't even realize that the bar was called Fat Tuesdays because it was mm-hmm. a New Orleans themed bar, mm-hmm. and that stayed in your head. And that stayed in my head. Wow. Wow. And Just like my years of started of getting my dick sucked by Joanne while she drives around her SL five hundred, <laughs> and I'm I'm in the passenger seat and she's sucking my dick while she's doing well, eighty. She's, yep. On the on the on, oh, I love that. on the uh, right next to the Biscayne, you know, <laughs> yeah. it's 1983, yes, sir, and I'm fucking 
I'm just getting my dick sucked. The, and co- like, the, fab- the cocaine, the fabric money cocaine mm-hmm. is coming and going. I'm like, yeah. this Reagan guy's bad news. And she's like, who cares? We're rich. She's like, shut up. <laughs> Like you're right. I guess I'll just go numb. I guess we'll just we'll just call this a numb decade. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we'll just write it all off, and that's what we're living in right now. Mm-hmm. Whether you feel it or not, basically you're getting your dick sucked by Joanne from by Joanne's Joanne fabric from Joanne once fabric. a year. You think all these things are happening? No, it's still are, the eighties when she. Oh, in the eighties she sucked amount. daily. Yeah, yeah, but now I'm talking not about daily. the present day, and Joanne's fabrics has turned into an allegory. Yeah, sort of a a a, a, a story for modern times. Yeah. You know, because who the fuck knows what Joanne's fabrics is? So true. Who the fuck is Joanne? Does it matter? <laughs> it doesn't. You just, really you go through there and She's you feel... She's a concept. She's not a girl that te- sucks your dick anymore. The textures and it's all just, you know, broken promises. You know That's what I mean? so fucking yeah. true. But what were the promises even to begin with? You were the liar. Mm-hmm. You were never an airline pilot. You weren't a pilot. You worked the door. Yeah. But you thought you were entitled to and the And now benefits. it's just another write-off. It's it's it's, it's top-down Novocaine from the top. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So, absolutely. 100%. I am absolutely following. Real, <laughs> but disengaged. Yep. yep. That is I our, ate too much. What does it even de- mean to get know. pussy from, I don't know. from I just, Joanne's fabric? I ate too much deli meat. Now I'm having trouble <laughs> thinking. Yeah, we got deli sandwiches and then Nick no, went back to the deli and got I wouldn't say we got deli, deli sandwiches. And so you said you were like, we have to try this place. No, I, I know this place. The, we have to try My so friend I said, Joshua. I had a pretty good yeah. sandwich. Tell me about it. My friend Anus <laughs> told me about this place. <laughs> well, you guys are going to have to listen to the next episode where we discuss yeah. the deli sandwich. My friend no. anus and semen told me about this. <laughs> dude. Those are not my friends. Do you have ja. that? It's Adam's friends, anus, anus and, semen. and semen. and I'm Jacques. Yeah, we've, okay. all, we've come from Europe to wear little girls' clothes and hold hands with Adam. And get $40 sandwiches. And we're twins from Germany and we flank <laughs> said, Adam everywhere he goes. I said the sandwiches were too expensive. <laughs> Yeah, you I say already you preface. You we told us they were too expensive. You said there's an expensive sandwich place. We said let them just order sandwich. The sandwich is decent. And then you're like, but it's very expensive. But when you bit, and then into we didn't the react. Sandwich, and it's then, a good. It was a good. When sandwich. When you bit into the sandwich, you said this is not twenty dollars. Because my first, that was my first reaction. <laughs> because you I said it so it. many times, you fucking. <laughs> because a sandwich shouldn't be twenty dollars. Okay. Some it's, of them it's, can it's be. A of the cats' principle. sandwiches should be because they pay those guys That's well. That's barely a sandwich. And That's, it's a you get a shit ton of meat. Mm-hmm. You get two I've, slices can I say of rye bread. I've never been there. It it's, seems overrated. You'd like it. It's a it's, restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> Do they have food there? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, got oh, you'd food. like it. They have a menu. <laughs> I wonder if that place is going to survive the mm-hmm. pandemic. Um, you just stop it like a Best Buy. Like, what the hell is where the those, fuck? Are the where co- the fuck is the fucking the, meatloaf? <laughs> where's the food? Do you have what kind? Do you have scallops over in the refrigerators? Hello? <laughs> is, was, is, is Hello? Hello? <laughs> Uh, speaking, <laughs> uh, this is Stavros. <laughs> is there ear to the <laughs> ear to the door yeah. of the refrigerator? Yeah. You rip the handle off the refrigerator. You're holding it like a telephone. <laughs> uh, reality check calling. <laughs> Uh, it's the it's the future on the line. They want their clothes back. <laughs> People are like, yeah, he's going into diabetic shock. He's, yeah. He thought there'd be pudding in the fridge. He thought they did you just rip ass? Maybe about five minutes ago. Oh, it just God. got over it here. It got over here, dude. It's, it's like a poison. Now you cloud. understand my little speech about <laughs> the past and the future. I've forgotten <laughs> your speech. Fabric. I gotta say, I've forgotten your speech. Oh, man. I would, I would like to get my dick sucked by an old lady one. that was so good at yeah. it in the 60s. Mm-hmm. And she's just got a little twinkle in her oh, eye. Oh, my God. Yeah. She knows that she sucks. I would like to get head from a a very uh, sixty-five-year-old. There was a girl I knew, and we like we had to we went to Dallas and stayed at her like mom's apartment. Oh yeah, I know, I know her. Her mom like lived in like a uh, like you know she had like a nice she was like a single woman who was older I guess, and so she like stayed alone in this like very curated nice apartment. But that that girl was telling me like. I guess she had, there was a lube, like we needed, I, but it, it doesn't, the point is she had to get lube and she knew where to get it in her mom's room because like, she like walked in on her elderly mother getting like fucked in the ass. <laughs> 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 yeah, right. 
And uh, yeah, she that rocks. Right. So she, uh, she. Wow. Yeah, she fucking. And but her mom was like very much one of those like pearls. Like maybe I just put it together that way because we were in Dallas and I was thinking yeah. of the show Dallas. Right. But I imagined her very much as like a yeah, like a dick sucking Mm -hmm. little like Mercedes Roadster firecracker. Yeah, a little Mercedes Roadster driving (laughs) Ursula haircut, cock sucking grandma, Mm -hmm. cock sucking dramatic Texas grandma. She has to take uh, her clip clip on costume. The bitch room. Me and the girls are going out for drinks. Like, yep. The girl, the Rose. Mm -hmm. Wasn't that her name from? why am I blanking? On the old bitch show, Golden Girls. Yeah, I'm, I was thinking of Fat Bitch from Titanic, Kathy Bates. No, nah, I don't want oh. that. Yeah. No. But that, she's in that genre. Jean, Jean, mm. Jean mm. The she is. That Jean Roy. The Jean Roy of Pussy. Yeah. Um, yeah. That oeuvre. 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 Yeah, I would, I would ab- absolutely get a fucking dick sucking from a lady like that have her take off her her long costume jewelry clip on earrings before she gucks you off no i want the i want the dangling i want the the jingle jangle what do you mean taking off her earrings she takes them off that's like her uh you out of your goddamn that's her sign that she's ready are you out of your goddamn mind she's ready to guck no the jewelry stays on the jewelry stays on i want opulence opulence when i get my dick sucked yeah yeah I want it to be a fucking. I'm a talking home. about a businesswoman. This is somebody you, you're like cheating on your wife with, but it's a. It's not even a lateral move. Yeah. Oh, no, de- definitely negative. And this is yeah. Somebody in the office. You're doing is, it for the thrill. You're both. Look, we both need that. We both need to be cheating. Mm-hmm. Yeah. For starters, because that's a power move. Totally. It's, it's 1983. Cool to yeah. We're lawyers because that the, no one was a, in finance at the time. Yeah. The best like, thing I you, tried, but I was a lawyer. They were like, "Sorry, no stocks yet." Yeah, no stocks. The only thing you can be is a trial attorney. Mm-hmm. That's that was power back then. Yes. And you cheat with the J- Joanne from Joanne. Joanne from Joanne's Fabric. She's got who works at the lawyer place. Who she's a lawyer. Mm-hmm. She's That's a lawyer. where she got her fabric. Yeah. She sued. She for sued them. Um, a Haynes yeah. company. She her her, her co- business card said Joanne Fabrics. Uh, suing? No, sewing. Yes. Mm, and That's people are good. like, "What is this a card? What for? do you she's mean?" She's like, "I'm a lawyer, but also I own this company." <laughs> <laughs> So wait, but yes, suing then I guess. And they're like, she's like, shut up. She's like, that's just I needed something. Shut quiet. the fuck up. Just shut up. Do and you want your cock? Your dick. They're not. <laughs> just put your cock in my mouth <laughs> and fuck up my eight hundred dollar haircut. Yes. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah. That was, which is the height of fashion. Right. It's moment. just like a koosh ball. Yeah. Like yes, yes. 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 Koosh but, ball. Yeah. A little yeah. fucking spiky shit. I had to go mm. see a gay guy to do this to me. Yeah, you did. But why? Why'd you stop the bit to tell us what happened to you, Adam? No, that's what the lady no, did. You had to go see a gay guy. No, that's to do this what to... Joanne Fabric. For everyone said at home, Adam said I had to just go see a gay guy to do this to me, and then he held open his asshole for me and Nick to look at, mm-hmm. it, and it was completely. Blown and Porky out. the pig stuck his head out. <laughs> Adam's gay, folks. Ed, there's a lot more in it's, here, folks. There's come in here, folks. That's what, what, disrespectful. What the fuck was Porky the Pig doing in that hole anyway? Like, yeah, what was getting, that? What's that end with? They're like, and getting, how about at the end of the cartoon, a pig comes out of an asshole? Says, that's <laughs> yeah. all, folks. Yeah, dude. It yeah. was kind of like a target. That maybe? sounds pretty loony, loony to me. It is quite loony. Yeah. It's so funny that that was like, you know, during the war effort, they're like, well, we need all kinds of racists. Some of them will go to the war to kill, and others will stay home to teach children about the Japanese. (laughs) And how treacherous they are. Yeah. (laughs) And that's that's where cartoons came from. That's Mm -hmm. true. Is indoctrinating the children. Very true. To invaginate them. You think to tell them about pussy. Mm -hmm. What were you going to say, Adam? I just wonder if that, that... I was laughing about, I was at Costco the other day, I was laughing about, like, just accusing a Chinese lady of copying me, Mm -hmm. like, with the shit I'm buying. (laughs) (laughs) You're fucking copying. Stop buying. Stop copying me. Stop buying four dozen eggs and the ten pounds of rice. Don't fucking copy me. (laughs) That's what they're fucking doing, dude. The Chinese. Did you see that pool party rave they had in Wuhan? Yeah, they're rubbing it in. They're rubbing it in. That's our favorite kind of shit to do. Mm -hmm. We love pool party raves. I know. We're all stuck inside. The Chinese met. are all grinding on each other. I know. That's I copying. Even, I didn't even know Chinese gay got pussy like that. They, I didn't even know. Yeah, I didn't know they liked eating. Yeah, yeah they like a big pussy getting bananas the over there. Little boy got fucked in his ass. <laughs> Did you see that video, Nick, with the Wuhanese? Yeah, I didn't care about it. What wow. video? 
The one you're talking oh, about. Are the, we? Are there's riots again, right? The police. Is, <laughs> I actually do have some. Stop! I saw your your uh, girlfriend got stuck in the Suez Canal. No, no, she, I don't. Yeah, know I heard that. She's not a nurse that. anymore. No, no, she's. I she fucked lost the nurse. She's in cargo. She's, she's in cargo. Nur- the nurse. Because the fuck a nurse ship. We already it's been through the this. Economy. I agreed to this because no? I fuck. Because the nurse is if the, no, nurse, the nurse ship is my wife, is your wife. I get to fuck all the nurses on it. Your okay? girlfriend. I'm is not the cargo fucking a bunch ship. of Egyptian cargo motherfuckers. Yeah, and you fuck all. I the, don't fuck them. You fuck all the. I'm the captain now. It's a different boat. It's true. You fuck all the Somalis. I don't fuck. First of all, a pirates didn't take over it, so they wouldn't be Somali. Well, how? else did it get stuck i don't know but just bad f- i don't know it's you not should, my wife you let those pirates no nope. your wife we've been over your this. girlfriend we've sorry. been over this first of all it's my wife yeah there's no one who's love popping it open and smelling the good mm. cushy dreams just getting blasted in the face Aww. You get the pre-rolls oh that's what's so fucking good <laughs> that's what i say every time i crack yeah. open and yeah. <laughs> oh my fucking god oh that smells so fucking good yeah out here in cali we love smoking uh <laughs> fa- fucking uh pre-roll cbd <laughs> Yeah, I have brain damage from growing up in California. From too much sun. <laughs> yeah. From driving up to Frisco to huff gas with a girl who's got her eyeball pierced. <laughs> yeah, really cool stuff. We got some friends up in Humboldt. She showed us how to shove the weed in her ass. <laughs> mm-hmm. I'm not allowed to smoke weed anymore because the government will take away my skateboard. But that's why I smoke cushy dreams. Yeah, basically, any person I've talked to for more than 10 minutes has immediately put a gun in their mouth and blew their (laughs) brains out. Anybody that I used to live with a woman that had this older, this this guy who must have been in his 40s that would just come fuck her. But I would get stuck talking to him and he would (laughs) just fucking (laughs) He's like, yeah, taking the van up to Frisco this week. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, that guy needed some high quality CBD yeah. from Cushy Dreams. <laughs> Damn. It's because French people are retarded. They are. They are. Yeah. Like, ah, my friend Chucky. I'm French Chucky. Hey, he's a big rat, but I love him. <laughs> <laughs> Bonjour Chucky. Bonjour Chucky, prof. Plus fuck Plus fuck Plus Bonjour Chucky. Plus fuck my mother now. <laughs> Merci to fuck my ass, um, Chucky. Hey, bon chef, why I fuck my ass? <laughs> <laughs> I watched John Wick again last Respect. night. Respect. Yeah. You know what I watched? That's I watched him take off a man's pants with a fucking pencil. <laughs> <laughs> I watched him bring a man to orgasm with a pencil. <laughs> he, he, he hit his G spot from the back with only a pencil. I watched a movie. That's that's what all those. It's you think there's there's no such thing as a Cockney accent. That's just retarded British people. <laughs> <laughs> there's no other option for people with a series of learning disabilities but to go into crime. Yeah, oh yeah. And this story told all the. No, the way we do in the robbing. Uh, which way did it? Way. Which way did a bakery? I'm gonna get the baguettes and sell them for which, more. I'm trying to have a. Uh, what are they called? Biscuit. No. Yeah, they call cookies biscuits. Fuck that. It's mm-hmm. fucked up, right? That's very fucked up. That's Lo- a- lock, stock, and two extra chromosomes. <laughs> 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 yeah, and the guess who the director is? Gay Richie. Oh, yeah. nice. Thank you. Mm-hmm. He just makes the all the retarded guys kiss. <laughs> <laughs> For his movie. <laughs> I uh, started doing a... I'm not married to a daughter. I'm married to a guy instead because I'm gay. Who's like the male equivalent of Madonna? Male Donna? Uh, The male equivalent? McDonald? 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 (laughs) I'm like a virgin. (laughs) (laughs) That's who Gay Richie's husband is. I'm like a virgin. (laughs) (laughs) McDonald. I come in there, they see me, they say, look at this... Look at this guy, he's like a virgin. <laughs> I've never seen an asshole so tight. I've never seen anybody so beautiful, he's like a virgin. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, McDonald. <laughs> That's why I love having sex with oh, them. I can't even I can't, always, I can't even do British anymore. Yeah. I'm Gar Richie. I saw I'm Guy have Richie. Have you seen a picture of Baron recently? 
pranks. What else is in the news, folks? Demi Lovato, uh, non-binary. Yeah. Really came out as they them pronouns. I'll take yeah. some of that. They it's them. Interesting pushy. coincidence. Interesting that uh, she comes out as non-binary they. the same week that I come out as uh, not being gay. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's almost like the media it completely ignored mm, my right, story. That's right, a, that's like a Friday. Because you remember stuff. that? Just like this, like four days ago, I was insisting that I wasn't gay. Yeah, right. <laughs> but see, the problem is no one was buying it. <laughs> that was the problem. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, the old <laughs> tragedy of the market. Yep. <laughs> I believe is what the philosophers call that. You couldn't, you couldn't unload. You couldn't yes. fucking. I trade have all of this. Shit I have all of this for I'm, Nick is straight stock. <laughs> it was trading at negative yeah. five hundred thousand dollars. I believe somehow. they call that the tulip crisis. <laughs> the great Danish tulip crisis. Oh wait, you want to talk about a Friday news dump? Didn't they say that? Uh, yeah, We've got to go back. Mm-hmm. We've got a high ground. Marty. <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> Marty. I figured out how to take a gay car and use it to rape girls in the past. <laughs> they don't know what DNA is in the 20s, Marty. They'll have no way to track me down. <laughs> That's why we have to rape our own grandmothers. <laughs> Even if they do preserve the DNA, it won't make any sense. <laughs> They'll think she did it to herself. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't really want to do that, Doc. Marty, you got to check this out. I shoved a Rubik's Cube up my ass and solved it. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is pretty cool, Doc. That's pretty cool, Doc. I got to say, this is one of your science tricks. Don't you fucking love science? <laughs> I love to fuck a guy. Uh, and then he start. He has so go shake. to bluechew.com, promo Blue. code Cometown. And promo code Penis. <laughs> promo code Penis. Promo code Gary Penis. <laughs> <laughs> They're going to send it to you in discreet packaging. Yeah, I'm, uh, this is actor Gary Penis. <laughs> what is it? What is he saying? <laughs> <laughs> that is what Gary Penis sounds Gary like. Gary Penis. <laughs> Scary Panis. How this the is fuck Gary. did it take us so long to get to Gary Panis? <laughs> I think we've said it before. He's, a, oh, he's okay. a Hollywood Republican. Yeah, my name's Gary Panis. I'm here for Bluetooth.com. <laughs> mm-hmm. I was wondering if any of the people listening, you listeners at home, might have a penis that doesn't work. Mm-hmm. What does Gary Sinise sound like? Something it's like not, that. Yeah, uh, I don't. Think I, have so. no, I have literally no. I can't even. I can't even visualize his voice. You I know can visualize I can his all. face, but not yeah. his voice. Yeah. I remember when I was a kid and I I saw that Lieutenant Dan so was wait, having we say, sex. Oh yeah, it's promo code mm-hmm. come. Oh, down. is Gary Sinise Lieutenant Dan? Gary yeah, yeah, Sinise yeah. here. And I, when I was a, <laughs> when I was a kid, I was like, how is he doing that? He doesn't have legs. Gary Sinise. He didn't have a penis. <laughs> yeah, it was very thought. confusing. Mm-hmm. When they made me cut my legs off <laughs> to play the retarded guy in Forrest Gump. I don't know if he was retarded. <laughs> that movie was all about different kind of retards. Hence <laughs> the, the box of chocolate okay. speech. You got yeah. a mental retard, a racial retard, and then a body retard. Okay, I think Bubba was also... And Jenny gone. was a gender retard. <laughs> That's, <laughs> That's true. what a woman is. I, I, I can buy into that. <laughs> and then everybody gets AIDS. And the moral mm-hmm. of the story is don't fuck your disabled kid's principal just to trick him into... That's right. Mm-hmm. I mean, how sweet is it? The only benefit of being retarded is that you don't have to go to school. And the yeah. ping pong, too. And then your mom you get yeah. really uses good her pong. pussy to make you do homework. Mm-hmm. Fucked up. That's a yeah. bad yeah. mom. That's a shitty mom. I would fuck Sally Fields, though. Yeah. To mm-hmm. let the kid into school? <sighs> fuck yeah, dude. You know, I fucked Sally Fields. <laughs> <laughs> Gary, just stick to the... Uh, <laughs> just stick to the copy. Can you stop doing a Jack Nicholson impression? <laughs> It's not my fault. I don't know what I sound like. (laughs) Why the hell would you hire Gary Sinise to do VO for your commercial? For your cockpit commercial. For your bluechew.com commercial. Promo code come. Promo. That's neither here nor there. The point is, Rita Wilson is is Greek. Okay? Her mother is ethnically Greek. And that's why she's fat and is missing a tooth. And she's not missing a tooth. And she looks good. And she's bald. She's not bald at all. She was... (laughs) <laughs> She's married to an icon, Tom Hanks. Thank you very much. You know the pussy's got to be good I don't to know. ensnare Tom I don't Hanks. Know. 
Ike. The push has got to be good to marry like Tom Hanks. CIA asset. You, you need to me. shut the fuck up about. You're gonna say about Tom Hanks? Yeah, he's, I think he's a CIA asset. You're such sure. a fucking hater. How is he the first guy to get coronavirus? He All of a sudden, dude, he the got chi- the Chinese motherfuckers got it first. When and when everyone was noticing that building without uh, windows. My name's uh, Mom Hanks now. Yeah, I got a big pair of tits <laughs> filled with milk. <laughs> It's me, uh, Mom, Mom Hanks. What happened? You, uh, you got milk. Uh, <laughs> that's good. That's good. I've been I, on I an really island. Splash, but it's from my pussy juice. I've yeah. been on an that's island uh, <laughs> drinking my own titty milk <laughs> uh, for years. Uh-huh. Um, no, uh, remember that building in Lower Manhattan? With- that's a French <laughs> idiot. Uh. Uh-huh. Keep your French bullshit over there in the, I'm on sorry, your little dude. box. Yeah. You're the in one the who corner. went to Paris uh, without me. Uh, yeah, I went with my my life partner. Le you made fun of me for asking. <laughs> le pou, le pou caca penis, I said, fuck people. What is summer? I know winter is Inverno, which is a cool. You know, we mentioned the Pepe Le Pew thing. Esta, but something that didn't get mentioned. It is very f- l'estat du Pusadich. It is very funny I that, love that, that. <laughs> that Pepe Le Pew was canceled because he didn't ever. He never because they're like, oh, he's a rapist, but. Because it's a cartoon, nobody was like... He never actually gets the pussy. He doesn't, he doesn't rape. All yeah. he does is do exactly what Andrew Cuomo did. That is true. So yeah. you can't, you can't like be mad at conservatives for defending a cartoon that they probably never even watched as a child. Mm-hmm. Right. When you're doing it with an actual person who is an Italian. Yep. Which, which is, is disgusting. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, no. Pepe, you know, I draw a line at seeing Pepe rape that cat in an alley. Yeah. But beyond that, he just has no game. It's like the babe.com article about Aziz. It's Aziz. Yeah. yeah. I remember yeah. when I was a kid, I wanted him to get pussy. Well, no, so bad. Aziz. I wanted Pepe to find love could, because they were the same color and shape. Yep. Which yeah. Which is how things should be. Yeah. <laughs> in, your, in, your, in your eyes as a <laughs> yeah. child. Everyone the same color and shape should get yeah. the fuck. Maybe, maybe a lot of people aren't racist, they're just completionists. Yep. Mm-hmm. It's like whites should be with whites and blacks should be with blacks because that's how you organize things on a shelf. Right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's autistic. Yeah, <laughs> God is autistic. Yeah, I don't that's have what, a, yeah. I don't have a problem with mixed race couples in the sense that there's anything wrong that these people can't love each other. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's just it throws off the decor. It's there's now how, where am I going to know where anybody is? Well, how about this? You could put their children though with like an Egyptian guy. You know what I mean? Like yeah. you don't care about. Uh-huh. You you're fine with mixed race. It's mm-hmm. just they have to come out the same color. Yeah. So like an Indian guy could be with a Puerto Rican lady. Yeah. You know what I mean? And uh vice versa in your completionist mm-hmm. view. It's yeah. all about hue. You're more like a, a co- you're a color swatch guy. You're like a guy who works at sure you're a color match yeah. guy. Yeah. That's what you are. There's also all the tigers. We should kill all the male tigers and uh kill all the female lions. Mm. And then they're only allowed to to create one ligers. The liger. Well, yeah, a lion with the mane with the stripes, and then create one species. Just because there's there's not enough variation between lions and tigers. No, but the ligers. Animals. The ligers can't procreate. That's the only problem. <sighs> okay. Sorry. Well, I look apologize. who knows okay. facts. <laughs> wow. Oh no, you're right, Adam. You we actually something? want Egyptians to only be able to marry light skinned Puerto You remember Puerto something from Napoleon Dynamite? <laughs> So neither can mules. <laughs> nice man. That's the one thing I remember we from do life know science. That. Everyone knows that. But I have mm-hmm. to say, it's pretty cool that you can create. It's something. a good test for people if you ask some shit like that. You're like, "What's the deal with mules? Can they?" And if they answer, then you don't need to talk to that person ever. Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't that sound like a ho- no? You don't ask them. You just talk about. That sounds mules. like a wow. sad yeah, life. You see if you can bring it up. Yep. Or you do. You get. You sounds go, like a great life. You're like, what's, you what do you mean? You do hard you labor want? and then you can't. Yeah, you go, you is, can't is, have a, is a child. Is irregardless a word. And then yeah, if yeah. they go off, you know. Yeah. Mm. That's it. You're done. Yeah. No, but again, you're I don't, canceled. I don't think you can ask them directly because that's kind of like. No, you have to drop it. You have to drop it. You have to like. You can. You can now, pal. You can now what? We're living in an age of permanent interrogation. That's Everybody true. under Every- the under the bright light, smoky nah. room. That's the world we live in. No, we don't. We have to be a, a beacon for not snitching. Yeah, I'm trying to be a bacon for going to Bob Evans after the show. 